I just want to make sure that the Belizean uh, people understand that we have not withdrawn completely from their FOB. We do have presence there. The presence will remain until a team of engineers go down and they assess the situation and see how best we can fix um, the issue that we have with erosion in that area. As I noticed when I was there, um, the, the river and the sea is already under the building and it's unsafe. So therefore, uh, we decided that let them move to Barranco. We can do the patrols from Barranco. Our presence is still at the FOB, um, but we will not have the soldiers risk their lives um, because it's unsafe. A team of engineers is coming down and they will be assessing the situation and giving us recommendations as to how we can permanently address it. I believe that um, the, the situation got to this point because maintenance and, and actually um, the FOB was just left to deteriorate and, and we cannot um, have that happen. We, we consider the safety of our soldiers um, to be priority and in that case um, now we are assessing and making sure that we get the recommendations um, from the expert to see how we can um, address the situation. One of the biggest issue is uh, the the river and the strong current and, and the and climate change on a whole. You know that is what is eroding um, that area and in the and the years that um, that have passed some kind of mitigation process was done but that was not enough and um, we have seen where now what used to be um, land is now underwater and um, so the recommendation will come the experts um, are, vis are visiting today and they will let us know what we need to do to ensure that the integrity of the building and the safety of our soldiers are kept.